Hello everyone and welcome back to No Man's Sky. Well, I thought I had three days off to work on things and, you know, make videos for you guys, but it turns out that my work may need me tomorrow because they can't do anything without me. Which makes me sad. So sad. So we're here. I think we landed here in the last episode and we were going to rob this place, but we don't have enough room to get it all in our current condition. So what can we shift over? Yeah, that's, that's close. What do we have a lot of? We have two stacks of iridium, so we can send that over. Uh, we could get rid of the carbon. Easy enough to get. Alright, see how we do. <laughs> we'll just hide from him. Alright, so... Got them both in one hit. Yeah, I do want to go into the menu and get rid of this and get some more stuff. Alright, success. Whoops. And we're full. That was perfect. Alright, let's take off. And do some searching for a place to sell at. Oh, there's an observatory there. And we have an anomaly that's appeared in space. Three buildings close together. That's interesting. We only have one creature left to get as well. So we can get that money bonus. Stop scanning the building. But he's, they're not around here. Uh, no, that's not the door. Heading inside. As I stand on the terminal, tiny dots, or tiny drones, go about a series of perfunctionary cleaning routines within the pristine observatory. Clearly, the obs former observer was a stickler for cleanliness, but less conscious about monitoring incoming communications. Oh. To the phone. Let's see here. Seven, three, four, five, dash, three, five, four, seven. Dash five four seven three. No, that's not it. I'm gonna cough, hold on. 
I lived. Four, seven, three, five. Hey, that worked. Okay. All right. That's it? No signals? Really? <laughs> wow. Hey, a place to sell. Nice. <laughs> oh, yeah, we should try something. Um, let's sell off that emerald. Sell items from inventory. Oh, there's the emerald. All right. Thirty thousand, thirty five thousand copper, iridium, carbon, thorium. Oh, there we go. Titanium and plutonium. 30,000 a piece. So what does 100 titanium sell for? And what does a 200 platinum? All right, let's see here. Do, 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 do. Ah, there's the titanium. So 100 titanium. Getting closer. 100 titanium, please. Be nice if we could just type in how many we wanted to sell. All right, 6,000. And if we wanted to sell uh, 200 plutonium. Do I have zero plutonium on me? No, there it is. All right, so that's 8,360 plus 6,000. So as long as we had a huge supply of titanium, which we do currently, and a large supply of plutonium, we could actually turn that into big money if we had the room. <laughs> I was told this information and I was just verifying it, and it turns out that it's actually pretty lucrative. As long as you can find those things. Alright, so first off, we're going to sell this pl platinum for 137000 <clears throat> Alright, that's opened us up some room in the inventory. Yes, yeah, much room. Alright, this one. Oh, it's gonna be annoying having to go right every time. All right, we're low on plutonium already, so let's sell those off. All right, they're being sold for less, so let's sell off. One of those, well, 30,000 is still pretty good. For those, 120,000. That's pretty good. So, and it made a ton of room. Ah, come on. What do you got for us? Unknown life form. Clarify unknown life form's intelligence. 
All right, life form sees me complicated. Research data to see if I can comprehend it. I look, I must look blank because the life form instead projects three holographic images in, to my visor. Clearly seeking my opinion on intelligence levels of my species, I've shown a vacant looking slug <clears throat> in more advanced beaked trader and a member of its own vastly intelligence, uh, intelligent electronic race. I'm gonna point at the trader. Live form was clearly expecting this answer. Ready to blueprint for me, which we already had. All right, let's take a look at this gun. It is a 23 slot. Compare. We have a 21 slot. You know what? Let's do it. It's cheap enough. There we go. 170 drops to 151. It's like, oh, you really do need this gun. All right, sweet. All right, there's, you can't transfer stuff. No, that's a ship thing. Okay, so we got a new gun. We got it cheaper because we needed it. All right, bolt casters useful. Cooling systems useful. Uh, beam intensifier. It's not very nice being over there. We're going to get rid of it. Uh, grenade launcher. Useful, but not in that position. Okay, scanner boost level 3. That's good. Alright, so here we want a beam focus, beam intensifier right there. Why did the whole place just shake? Oh, ship landed. Okay. All right. Uh, focus. And then we'll kind of curve back this way. Uh, intensifier. Uh, focus. Cooling system theta. Very useful. Uh, beam focus again. Very nice. All right, so what do we got left? Combat amplifier, combat amplifier, and a rail shot adapter. Don't need those things. So a range boost two would be good. If we got rid of the bolt caster and we threw in the range boost two on the scanner. Yes. And then an analyzer. We need that for the scanner system. Yes. Oh, but look at that. These things won't get the enhancements from this. Well, it's a waste, but why don't we get rid of this? And I hope I have the blueprints for those. Yeah. Okay, we'll put those there. So everything's getting an enhancement now. All right, we need a bolt caster, which we'll put over here. And we'll put the grenade over here. Well, maybe not. We'll put the scanners in first. Range two, we need carbon. And that plutonium over there, of course. boost 2. Oh, do I not have range boost 3? Really? No, there it is. Okay. I was worried. Alright, so that is the uh, the complete scan system. 
Short bursts are not very useful. Reload is okay. Plasma clip. Ammo capacity. Alright, and then... Grenade. Rebound grenades. Propulsion grenades. Travel at high velocity. Reload. Short burst adapter. Rapid fire. I guess rapid fire would be good for that. And any other grenade pieces that we want. Nah. We're good. We got one spot left. You know, might as well throw a gun thing in there. Short burst adapter. Might as well. Yeah, we got the money. Okay. Cool. That's an upgrade. It is getting quite hot out here. So let's see, we've been there, we've been there. So that's actually part of that one. All right, let's head into space. something. Whoa. <laughs> oh, it's a boring building. You know, we didn't save over there. If only we could turn off these little cutscenes. Because when you... Save again, it just doesn't do the cutscene. Oh, is that our last creature? I don't see it anymore. Anomaly detected. Nine out of nine. Let's get that money. Boom. Almost at the five million mark already. Hmm, it's pretty pretty close to our other weapon. It seems a little quicker. But I don't know if the blast range is as big. It is nice, though. I'd say the frame rate's probably better for it, if anything. It's too bad we can't get a sideways view. Ooh, titanium. Thank you. Crash, don't crash, don't crash. <clears throat> oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, titanium rock right there, boom.
Platinum and zinc. Uh, if only we had a better supply of zinc. We've got plenty of platinum. Alright, what do we got around here? Yeah, I noticed that word stone popped up down there. But we weren't gonna land again. Because we are we are low on uh, plutonium right now. Now we're out of plutonium right now. <laughs> Top of the mountain to you, laddies. I think we're gonna have to land somewhere. Start loading up on plutonium. If only I don't think we've ever seen plutonium in space. There's a red rock there. Uh oh. Everything kind of lit up right there. Oh, well, here's something useful. The plutonium, not this place. Whisper spilled from the shapes or sharp edges of the artifact. Recounting the dreams and memories of the Korvax echoes in my mother's tongue. A hundred million casting lights were dimmed. The great disconnection destroyed all that went before. The Korvax echoes became screams. Years stretched like millennia amidst the disarray. Yet slowly hope was reborn through logic. Grab that zinc over there. Would we upgrade to a new ship if I found it? Yeah. Might as well. It's not like the upgrades are that hard to build, and even if only we only got two of the common ones, it's not like we gain that much due to the Z axis of the map. Yeah. <laughs> There's some zinc. And we got two more zinc coming up. Ah, oh, the other zinc is up there. Let's get this thorium though. Turned me. There we go. Fifteen zinc from that one. Oh my word! It survived a grenade. Thanks for the titanium. We really need some plutonium, though. Wow. 
That, that chews through ammo, but that's awesome. Oh, hello. Alright, yeah, we'll head towards the uh, energy. Some energy is coming closer. That might be a problem with Scanner Range 3. It just uh, makes you think everything's closer than it is. carbon though. There it is. Yes, I know there's an anomaly in space. Double sideways word stones. Well, that's disappointing. We, I thought we would get a lot more energy out of that. A lot of thorium, though, but we can't fuel our takeoff thrusters with that. A shielding, or it has shielding against my weapons. There we go. Danium. Yeah, bring it on. We got the uh, ammo boxes, we can use that. Oh, some hurdium. That'll be useful. got that stone and here's our ship all right everyone I know this video is a little late going up but uh, I'll record the next one soon for tomorrow at 2 a.m. where I try to make a video every day for 2 a.m. especially for you European watchers thank you everyone for watching this is Billy on the gun jam C channel signing off bye bye